the flashback is done and we should be now fighting the demons but i've been saying this for the last like five episodes god damn the pacing of this show i don't like we can agree that the pacing has been incredibly slow right each episode has been pretty well, the, the rose flashback has been good but i feel like shit has just been really really stagnating and yes i i have heard this thing too apparently we are now at chapter 10 of the manga we are literally doing one-to-one -one translation so we're taking this shit super slow so i hope that moving forward things will get a little bit more exciting and maybe we can have a season two announcement Let's begin today's reaction. CGI barricades? CGI tents? It's time to trip some death flags. You guys have to talk about your family back home. Your favorite restaurants you want to visit after this. <laughs> oh, look at that fit. His new jacket. <laughs> Inokami-senpai. <laughs> Are you here? Are you here to trip some death flags? <laughs> Yep. I think she wants to flex her new drip too. Look at this. This is a new drip. I haven't seen this blue jacket from her before. Look, she's already blushing, dude. Senpai, what do you got? Mid. I'm kidding. I'm, I'm mean to her for no fucking reason. It's just because Rose exists. It looks good. It looks good. Hmm? What? What's special about it? Makes lightning better? Conducting? Sure? Sure? I, I mean, I've heard that plants, like, you know, having a hobby to like, collect, maintain plants is actually very good for your heart. It's like, it's like very soul healing. Those, okay, sure. Where did the cactus come from? Then you should soothe my heart instead. Hey, she's fucking... Is she tripping death flags right now or is she just having a fun goofy time? She usually just has a fun time with us, but it's like, hmm... Is she, is she, is she tripping death flags? <laughs> Embarrassed of not myself. Embarrassed of you, senpai. Is he a tsundere? <laughs> I think this is death likes. This has to be death. I don't think she'll die, but we do know the vision, right? Of like, you know, Kazuki and Inumaki Senpai like dying in that vision. And we got to like decide who to save or how we're going to save them, right? <laughs> Conversation. <laughs> Imagine if the fucking roles were reversed, dude. Where's my knight? Mm. The bromance keeps going, dude. I swear I'll have you soothe my heart, dude. I think they're really baiting us. Like, this is the closest thing we're gonna get to a death, like, before a war, right? But, like, we already know that there's visions of them dying. I think that shit is too... It's too, like... It's the calm before the storm, right? And she's still not taking this seriously. And I've said this over and over. This girl does not take this shit seriously at all. And I'm just waiting for a moment in this anime where the anime actually slaps her in the back of the head and tells her, like, get serious. People can die in this show. Like, like things can actually go bad. But she hasn't really experienced that just yet, right? I, will the anime actually do such a thing? I don't think the anime will be too dark like that, right? Hmm. Surely nothing's gonna go bad. The Black Knight appears. Unhinged? Unhinged Black Knight? Damn, look at Kazuki, man. Good luck. His Majesty had a really cool speech last episode. <laughs> Will you? Are you sure? Maybe we should worry. The senpai is pretty excited. Ah, uh, I thought senpai was just being quirky. Maybe she actually is super scared and she's just kind of like using that to, you know, make her feel, you know, not scared. Didn't think of it like that. Yeah? Excited for what? 
killing people? Getting killed? Has he? Has he? We had that one moment in the cave. Yeah, I mean, that was kind of development, but I, I guess that he stopped in the monologue of like, ooh, senpai, my, my, my immersion of you is breaking. Yeah, that, that cave scene, after that bonding scene, maybe yeah, yeah. That one scene? That, that's enough to just forget about everything else? Susan, a cave scene? Or Kazuki coming outside his house for a reassurance scene. Which was better? You remember when Kazuki was scared of the war and Usato had to like reconcile him, right? And talk? But like the cave scene with Suzune, I, I feel like the ship with the bromance was a little bit better, dude. Oh, that's a death flag. If we make it back, death flag again. They all have to come back for Usato. All right, here we go. What's going on? Demons? What? The Dark Knight? What? The Black Knight? Uh, just a CGI army of demons? I don't think I've seen Kazuki really fight yet. Let's see this. Okay, we're just long range assault right off the bat. It's not enough! <gasps> the fuck, they're gone! It was an illusion? <laughs> Oh shit, they got us! Oh my god, Tong! Yo! The boys? Even Gerd, every one of them looks so epic today! They're not fucking around! They're Usually they're just a bunch of idiots! Look how determined Tong looked here, dude! Holy shit! Yeah, it's the kidnappers, it's our kidnappers! Look at Tong! The kidnappers! Alright. I don't think any of them will die. Who the fuck is Zaruku? Alright. So we're saving the trump card for last. Man, I want to have to go to the front lines though. It's, it's too early. It's, it's way too early. It doesn't make sense for a healer to go out there right now. Actually, does it not make sense? Why would we not want Usato, a healer that can be helping fighting? Or uh, he, he can fight, but he can also heal. If Kazuki and, you know, Senpai are like getting injured during the fight, him being at the front lines, wouldn't that like help? Right? What is the logic of him staying back again? Wouldn't it, I'm, I'm just, he could get hurt, right? If a healer is down, then everything is fucked, but he could also heal himself. I'm not really sure. <laughs> oh my god, Tong, that was fast as fuck. Damn, the war just started. They're fucked up. What happens when his mana runs out? She's like, die, please heal me already. Yeah, if his mana runs out, then it's over. The snake, snake round two, remember, because we already fought the snake, but they have a round two snake ready in the lab, right? Yeah, that one. V2. Oh, it's got a hat? <laughs> it's got like a little helmet? I don't know, it's a new design? I feel bad. What is this dude? Why? It just... You don't... It, the title was Unhinged Black Knight, right? The knight has been so casual, so like nonchalant. Even the way they talk, it just sounds like they don't give a fuck, right? It's not like a proper demon. So like, what are you? Oh, 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 hey, hey, episode's over, guys. NPC 243 just won the war. It's over. We can go home happy. Surely that's not going to happen. So what, he doesn't take damage or what? You don't take damage or what? I can't see what happened. The unhinged Black Knight. I didn't even see anything. What, what happened? What? Where'd he get injured? Stabbed? But we didn't see anything. He coughs up blood. So whatever damage the knight takes, the person that did the damage will take that injury is what I'm assuming? Oh, 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 oh. The fuck? <laughs> the kidnap- Dude, did you see? Did you see? Look, look, 
at the look at the gust of wind. Look at the gust of wind here. See? Special stink water. Gust of wind is gone. Gone like the fucking wind, dude. Holy shit, our boys are fast. The kidnappers. That's right. <laughs> The voice is now being a lot more emphasized. It sounds like a woman, right? It sounds like a woman voice actor, huh? So the, the Dark Knight's probably a girl? Yeah. It was kind of ambiguous before this, but I think it's confirmed now. Senpai, uh-oh. Bro, your teeth are in bad shape. What is going on, bro? I, did Rose do that to you? Can't she heal these teeth back? That's fucked up. Also, I've always wondered, what is up with his eyes? They're like marbles, but then you look at his ears, right? He's probably not just human, huh? <laughs> yes, finally. Finally, let's let's go, let's go. Ooh, right hand man. <laughs> Don't say that though. Don't say that, death flags. Don't stop tripping death flags. I know they're just saying be careful, but still. I honestly don't remember the guy on the left. Did we see him before? The only night I remember that was actually memorable is the guy in the front guard, you know, the castle guard. I forgot his name too, but he, we always said hi to him. I don't think it's this guy. I've never seen him before. Maybe I forget. Oh, that... Did Thomas have a helmet on those episodes? Holy shit. Thomas is getting a lot of recognition, huh? He's still... He's like Rose's like private fucking guard to help her healers too now? Yo. Thomas won't die, right? Please don't. Don't die, Thomas. What? Yeah, that's the one from the vision. No time to be hesitating, bro. A smooch. Give me a kiss. He can't kill people? I guess we've never seen him kill. Special technique? Wait, are we gonna get an actual one-shot kill technique? What is this? Okay. Just words of courage or what? What? Don't say run away. Don't say run away. What is this? What is it? Wait, what, what, what? The way that was animated was odd. If you really have to take an enemy down... So they skipped it. It's a secret. It's a skip. But there is an ultimate technique. He, he is saying that must be some kind of ultimate move. So it's not just run away. Okay. All right. We got some kind of ultimate move maybe saved up. Okay. Something specific to Usato. All right, let's go. <laughs> Save him! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Using his healing magic to even like further physically boost. Rose is just like beating people while saving. That might be the first and the last time we'll ever see Rose Giat, dude. Unfortunate that it's so far away, but hey, hey, enjoy it while it lasts. <laughs> oh, Inukami Senpai, looking cool. <laughs> You feel bad for them? No, it's probably just like the nature of war that she's getting used to. You got to see a little bit of her hes hesitation there, huh? I mean, they're like high school students, dude. What do you expect? So like the main threats are the snake and the black knight, huh? The apprentice of that general that, you know, fought Rose in the backstory. Black Knight. Yo, the Black Knight's armor is insane. It looks so cool, doesn't it? Are they really a demon? 
It's definitely not a human. Oh. <laughs> you deserve to die. I don't feel bad for you people. No, no, no. Listen to what she just said. Right? This is a different from any demon. Careful. Stay put. Stay up. Leroy Jenkins. Now, our theory is that whatever damage we do to Black Knight, the people take it back, right? You dum-dums. You dum-dums. Pain transfer? What is it? Oh. <laughs> I thought, okay. Because, like... I thought they, like, take the damage back. It's not just, like, something fucking comes out of the body and it's... That's fucking busted! So they can't take... It. How do you beat this thing? Maybe lightning shocks, right? What would lightning shocks do? So you attack and it just kind of hits you right back. It just counters it. Long range attacks. You gotta do long range attacks, maybe? Oh! What would that do? What would that, what would that do? Reflect. No, 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 no. See, it is what I think. It, it, the, the animation there was just like the melee damage was like, huh, what the fuck? So it's like wherever they get hit, the person that did the damage will take that hit back to reflect. Okay. Oh my god. Usato could win by brute forcing it. You know? Like constantly attack the Black Knight. You're gonna take the damage, but you can heal yourself. You know what I mean? And then just keep pushing the black. The black knight must have some threshold of damage that they can take until they break down. And Usato can keep healing until we get to that threshold. So we could get an insane Giga Chat moment. Like that's the only way that we can beat this guy. Someone that can heal at the same time. That's busted. Like what? You, just run. You can't even damage. Just run away. <laughs> no shot they're gonna die before Usato gets here. Yo, you better run faster, bro. Division again. I thought that vision only happens because we, you know, touched that furry girl. That sounds weird, but you know, when we were in contact with that cat girl, but he can still get repeated visions. The same one, anyways. <laughs> Gene! <laughs> oh, no, he's still keeping up. Oh? Who, who, who? NPC number 394. Nice. He came back for us. The NPC is getting a lot of lines. We still haven't fought the spider yet either. Huh? Huh? We should take the bodies of the demons and like throw it or like do damage with it. So that we don't take the damage, but like the corpse does. I don't know. I'm trying to just theorize. Like, wh wh what are we going to do, dude? No, don't. Oh, no, no, no. You're going to bank on the healing. Okay. Now what, though? You sure you want to cut it in the head? Oh, what? what did you think would happen? What did you think would happen? You actually hit it in the head after seeing what happens when you hit somebody. You get the damage back and you went for the head. That's insane. That is an absolutely insane game plan. And he said, as we have Usato, right? As long as we have Usato, we, got, we can get healed, right? What was the theory there? Okay, so if you obscure the vision, maybe. Backshots? Backshots on the Black Knight is the key? Surely it's not that simple. Oh, oh, wait. Inukami Senpai is so cool right now. 
ないことがオッケーカズキ Solar flare and then back shot. Wait, back shots didn't the first soldier? Yeah, exactly. What the, the first soldier went for a back shot. Oh no, oh no, oh, we're fucked. Oh, Inokami is about to die. <laughs> Yo, the Dark Knight's fucking- Listen to the Black Knight's voice acting right now. She's trolling so hard! Uh, are you sure? So, her under- I, My understanding of this was, like, back shots are okay. But she's- Inukami saying attacks that you can't sense because it's from behind. But, like, we've already seen a, an- Well, you don't know, right? The theory is Inukami saying, you know, something you can't, you know, anticipate. Inukami's so fast. The NPC, he was just running slowly. So maybe there's a distinction here. But I think we're about to see what's- You know, I think she's about to die. Uh, I mean, the Black Knight's, like, doing pretty good acting. Look at this. Why would you go from the front? Why would you go from the front? You don't do it! Yo, the Oscar winning fucking voice acting for the Black Knight! That's right through the stomach, dude. Oh, I mean, we can heal them, right? This is not a lethal damage, right? I mean, I don't. Okay, this is a lethal damage. Who are we fucking kidding? Both of them got fucking impaled through the fucking stomach. You trolled me. You were voice acting. You're like, oh, oh, oh. Any damage can get reflected. To set them up and bait them. No, 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 no. My theory still is the only type of person that can beat this thing is like Usato, right? There has to be some kind of damage threshold, right? I don't care if you're gonna like maybe like a thousand punches, right? We'll get hurt too, but maybe a thousand and one, you know, and then we can keep healing and we can keep healing and it's gonna be like a battle of attrition. Like, are you gonna give him first? Is Usato gonna give him first, right? That's gonna be fucking sick though. <laughs> Bro. This looks so bad. Holy shit. He literally looks like he got penetrated in the stomach. Look at that fucking vertical slit, dude. Oh my god. Kazuki, I'm sorry. I am so sorry I'm doing you like this, but goddamn. I mean, we had like a nice moment, right? It, it, during the episode where Kazuki was like talking about how scared he was. This is what he was scared of. And remember, there's still the snake. The snake still exists. Maybe Rose will take it out? Next episode. Well, we knew this was gonna happen. The vision told us, right? The vision told us that Kazuki and Inukami is gonna fucking almost die and we gotta go there and be fucking quick. So whose fault is this? Is it Rose's fault for not letting us go there in time? Is it fucking Usato's fault for not even knowing where Inukami and Kazuki was? Or is it fucking Inukami's fault for just saying, hey, maybe we can just go in because, you know, Usato will heal us. We saw this coming. Now, I don't think this is a show where they'll kill off these two people, right? Like, this isn't a flashback. Everybody already died in the flashback. I truly believe that we can save them somehow. I'm not sure what kind of healing is going to save Kazuki from being impaled through the stomach like this. Inokami's injury doesn't look as bad, huh, compared to Kazuki. I'm surprised that she's still up. But again, if there's anyone that can beat the Dark Knight or the Black Knight, it's got to be Usato, right? Again, just like who's going to last longer? Usato doing all these physical damages on the Black Knight and healing the entire time. Or the Black Knight, you know, trying to do reflect and reflect, but there has to be some kind of threshold. And I'm sure there's going to be a sick moment in the future. And that's probably going to be next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.